Good morning, boys and girls. I was supposed to go to Dead Creek per my previous video, but things kind of changed on me. Um, I did a little research on that body of water and determined that it was mostly filled with carp. Um, there wasn't a lot of bass there, and my buddy had actually asked me to go out to a body of water called Chittenden Reservoir. I fished there once before, only came out of there with a perch, so I kind of wanted revenge anyways. So, I am in the truck. It is 5.48 a.m. I'm running a little bit later than I originally wanted to be, and I'm heading to the water with the rowboat to see if I can pull some smallmouth and some largemouth out of this body of water. The game plan is going to be the same. The only major difference is that this body of water actually allows for me to use some more crankbaits, some more reactionary kind of baits. So I loaded up my gear, got all my cameras set up, I'm heading to the lake, hopefully we can find some and uh, get you guys some good video. So come along with me, let's get out there and catch some fish. Thank you a million times over. Nah. My eyes, I got like gray eyes. Like no fucking sun protection, bro. Oh, you cast them out. Spin that one. It didn't? No. Huh. Weird. It might be, uh. You have to reel them pretty fast to get them going. It was way over around there, I think. He was over around there, I thought, wasn't he? I thought I saw him right there, but. I, I saw someone over this way for sure. Me too, but I know I saw a guy a few moments later. Got him. Hey, you gotta catch up. Number two. Another one. Small mouth. Well, there's number two smallmouth. Got him. There's another one, guys. Little skipper. Oh, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. No, no. Another little guy. Darn it needs to be. There. You're free, buddy. Another smallmouth, man. So, guys, this is working pretty good. Nope. Get out of that tree. Come on. Oh man, really? It was at this moment that he knew. He f***ed up. Oh. I broke my tip right off. Awesome. Kind of spotted a log back here, guys. I'm gonna to try to drop a Senko right on it. Let's see what I can get going here. Got one on, guys. Good deal. Good deal, guys. Look at that. 
Got him. Finally. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. If you give up, you can get off and go back swimming. I know. I'm trying. Hey guys, I'm going to end my day with a fish story. So my last fish catch of this trip, I went into a little cove, caught a smallmouth, decided to duck out. Something told me I needed to fish this other little corner. Got over there, fished for a little while, actually packed up all my gear, gave up. I saw a big blow up, decided to go check it out, and there was a massive largemouth hanging out by a log. I decided, what the hell, let's try it. Grabbed the trusty old black and blue yum dinger, and after about four or five casts, I managed to land him. So I'm about to show you guys that footage, and then I'm gonna end this video. Oh my God. Look at the size of the ass. Oh my God. Bass is huge. Holy Oh my God, I got him. I got him. Oh, look at the size of that guy. Got him. I got him. Oh, look at the size of that guy. Wow. Holy. Wow. I got Oh my god. Oh my god. I, I can't. Oh my god. You 
stay still, dude. Stay still. Hey, 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 hey. Really? Oh my god. Oh my god. Really? Photo. Oh my god. Look at the size of that bass, guys. All right, buddy. You're going free. I'm done.